Hello and welcome to Crusader Kings 2, Holy Fury and Iron Sentry. That's my land. How long before you take it? One month. Okay, man, stand up. We're gonna take a look at what's happening a little bit later. First, let's take care of this problem. Okay, everyone, go this way, wait for my command. In fact, I'm going to stand the army here. And I'm gonna lead this one. Hmm. The Battle of Werven. Things are going well, when suddenly I hear an embarrassment huss from nearby, spinning my sword ready, my mace. I see the enemy commander, Ulfric. Awkwardly attempting to climb a rock. I think he's trying to escape the battle, my lord. The soldier next to me uses. <laughs> I'll kill him myself. Wait, he won. You're kidding, he's minus four. Ah, weird. Anyway. So, Byzantines, who are you fighting against? Bulgaria, and you? 7,000 men. Can I offer to join your war? No. Now, I am betrothed to this girl, and her parent is this guy. Let's try to form an alliance with him. No, because he likes me, he is the same dynasty, same interest, but political concerns. You're in bloody Egypt. Let's send you some alcohol. Speaking of which... Let's hope that Hoon doesn't kill me. How long before we can actually switch our law? 54. Okay, six years. We're gonna wait, but first... Can I declare war on you for something? Free captives. Claim Apulia. Ooh, that will make the boars a little bit prettier. Okay, let's go and try to save this place. So first, declare the war. Hmm. I didn't know this was yours. Ah well, next time. No, no, not my troops. My troops are expensive. Go with these guys. We have 10,000 men. I say let's send them down. I'm gonna take command of here. Also, we do need commander sent. This guy is still winning the elections. Um, let's change that. Let's vote for the Kaiser of Bulgaria. Do you actually have any territories? Not territories, any claims. Yes, you have a weak claim to the Empire of Germany. And you became a skillful commander. Good for you. We can acquire some ingredients. Let's go to the hills. Or the farmlands, that, that works too. How's this going? The great or the small band of hunters, King Caro and I have set out to hunt animals in the forest in an attempt to gather animal parts. These ingredients will be invaluable in an experiment to understand the aspect of the world. Why am I not voting for you, actually, King? There he is. One vote. Let's make it two. Who's voting for you, even? No one. Well, that's because you're such a likable character. There you go. Now, if I die, the Empire will be secured in my dynasty. If I die the right way, and during the right time. Which reminds me, what are you trying to do? Okay, let's imprison you. Apparently not, it doesn't matter, you do have a child. He's an Egyptian, that's my father's friend. Let's not touch him for now. Hmm. 
this kinsman is a priest. What about you? You're trying to kill this guy. Can I imprison him? You know, we don't need the money right now. Hmm. That's a lot of plots. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. Okay, let's tell you to stop blocking the plot. Thank you. Can I end the plot now? No. Is he my rival? Yes. Well then. I'm gonna send you as a special interest and I'm gonna try to kill you right back. I could do him. Recently been in a duo. Right. That happened not long ago. 12,000. Hmm. I believe we can win this. So, first and foremost, we're gonna wait. 9,000 men. I'm gonna send you all here. 8.8. .8. Basically 9,000. The forest is full of anim with wild animals, even though they are elusive creatures, are cunning and more than enough to find their hiding places. Some of these parts will be very useful. Please don't lose that battle. I could actually ask you all to go to the middle and see if that's gonna work. Strong center. Weak flanks. Usually a horrible idea. Turn around. Jihad for Egypt. In the great Shia Caliph, Musa II has declared to call a jihad against the Kahif of the Kingdom of Egypt. He is a king. The Kafirs. In the Kingdom of Egypt. He urges all righteous Shia Muslims to take up arms against the developed king Miroslav II of Egypt. Miroslav. Well, he looks like a German, his name is German, so he must be German. Hmm. We'll see if they're gonna call us in. No, that, that didn't work. I need you to retreat. Your left-handed spider, the Greek soldier see how he charges me. His expression more than a wild animal. Then a man, for a moment, time stands still as I am watching his movements of a shining sword coming straight from my head. Oh, you're dead. 6,000. That was a huge victory for them. Should have been careful. Minus 10%. That was quite a huge amount of my armies he just killed. Well, I did not expect that. Can I go here? Is that a mountain? Yes. Okay, go there. Wait for my command. I want you to move over there. Now. And I'm getting sick. Wonderful. I'm glad I hired you, Carl. Okay, became a tough soldier. People are still trying to kill me. Stop it. Stop backing plot. Can I ask you to stop backing this plot as well? Thank you. Yeah, I'm growing weaker still. It's gonna be fine. I'm not gonna die through the measles now, am I? We're gonna take a look at that in a moment. First and foremost, who are you and why are you plotting against me? 
You should like me, so stop it. And this guy's gonna stop backing the plot. I mean, he can say no and just keep on hiding. That's all of them. Okay, everyone, go here, wait for the Byzantines. Actually, go here and besiege that. What is this area? A town. Come on, you'll be fine. Still wounded? Just do what is necessary. Don't get me killed. And I do feel better. Excellent. That'll be fine. I guess. Am I losing monies for some reason? Yes. I'm starting to think that Glitterhoof might fancy me. Oh. Now, this is quite a dilemma. On one hand, it's a horse. But on the other, I think it banged my dad as well. So, here is the question. Which, which part of the argument should I take? I mean, one of these things is very disturbing, but still. Okay, make the move. Aha! She fell for it. Wonderful. I can negotiate with this guy. How many rivals do we currently possess? Can I hire someone to help me? This woman? Advancement in medicine. Well, you did help me, so I'm gonna ask you to do what you can. So, 20, 40, 60. 70. What, no monies? Well, let's expel the juice. Actually, borrow money. I haven't borrowed any. Okay, that's 80. Oh, wow. Really, the horse has 5% plot power. You will die beneath my hoofs. Ninety-eight percent. That's good enough for now. Can I send my spy master to? Oh, the measles are gone. That was a quick disease, if I have to say so. I mean, the previous one did last for a lot longer. It was on a different character, and he died young, but still. Can I form an alliance with you? No. I would offer to join your war. How many men do you have currently? 30,000. That's a decent enough number. We're still losing money. Because we're paying the retinue. That's fine. As he's growing older, this guy, whom I have no idea who he is, is trying to become a decent marshal. Go ahead, then. Is that a mountain? That's hills. Okay, you go here and wait for them on that hill. And you go over there and wait for my command. And look, I took a good look at myself and thought about my weaknesses and strengths. After many hours of self-searching, I realized I have nothing to be ashamed of. Which one is better? I believe... Yeah, so let's go with Proud. And I'm no longer wounded. Yeah, I was long wounded longer than I was actually sick. Can I buy a favor for me? Eddie Goat, you don't like me enough. Hmm. I mean, there is no reason. It's 99.3%. Look at all the diseases everywhere. 
Oris is an intolerant, pathetic creature, and unwilling to perform the simplest of tasks or take the smallest responsibility. I should denounce his slothful attitude to all who can see it. Oh, he challenged me to a duel. That's nice. Challenge accepted. I can cut his hand off or kill him. Doesn't say that I'm gonna become ruthless. My opponent looks nervous, his armor's a little ill-fitted. I briefly contemplate asking if he would rather do this another day. A moment later I snap out of it, letting the fresh morning air sharpen my senses instead to stunch man soon, the ground groaning in pain. <laughs> I guess I broke his hand. Aim for his head next. Good. Any other rival I need to take care of? No. Perfect. Only friends and lovers. Okay, can I ask you to go... That's a mountain. Okay, you go here then, and you go over there. Wait for my command. I'm gonna ask half of you to move over there. It can support 16,000 troops. That's fine. This war is gonna be longer than I thought it would be. You sure you don't want to claim an alliance? We have a new heir, this guy. The King of Lotharingia. My brother in the Hermetic Order, Marud, has stepped forward with an idea for a ritual that might invoke the presence of a divine being. The prospect of petitioning the divine itself for knowledge is tantalizing, and the idea was therefore received with excitement in the Order. The secret of the world shall be laid before us. I'm not sending any of my ingredients for that guy. Let's hope he's smart enough. Find hermetic texts. My brother, I have a proposition which might interest you. A note letter detailing the possible locations of some lost hermetic writings came into my possession. We shall see. Uh, let's go with this one. Do we have any prisoners we can ransom? No. Summoning the Divine. The time for the ritual has come, and your order has congratulated in the spacious room. Symbols scatter the floors as you chant your hymn. And a fit Murud has, proved, uh, has provided with, um, with a new special type of incense. He claims it's necessary to make the eventual connection with the Divine Being. Before long it has been permitted on the air, and you inhale more and more of it. Hearing the drone of your fellow chant, you feel your soul disconnecting from your body and being ascent. Until it seems to connect with something, an, ent an entity touches your soul, though you cannot perceive it with any sense other than your mind's eye. It must be a divine being you have succeeded. You struggle to control your emotions, to call aside all your thoughts is the one burning question that you pose to this being. Okay, what kind of a person am I? What should I ask him? I am groomed, scarred, ambitious, patient, <clears throat> and proud. Oh, divine being, pray, me, uh, pray tell me, how does one become a god? Oh, the divine being has given me cryptic advice on the pursuit of theology. Is my forms, but which ample time spend mumbling it over afterwards. I believe I have deciphered what it meant. I look forward to putting it to good use. Divine advice minus one learning. What? I mean, my learning is still amazing. What happened? Gotcha. It's a small battle, but we will do great things. The night is deep. 
There you go. Minus three. A few more of these battles and we'll be fine and ready. Do you still like me, King? He does. Still can't form an alliance because the political concerns are outstanding right now. My wife has grown up. I mean, she is gonna be my wife now. We do need the money, so once we get betrothed... I'm gonna ask for the money. Thank you. Let's try to have a private conversation with you. And try to seduce her. She's homosexual, so that might actually not work. But when I move to caress her cheek, I catch the glints of a steel in woman's hand. You're going to use that on me. Hmm. Okay. Why did you try to kill me? She gained stress. And so did I. Let's use some eyeballs for a potion. The bribe we offered the priest of Pandant was enough to make him unlock the inner chambers of the church. We examined every nook of the canny per clues of the scroll's hiding place. On the fifth day, one of the servants announced that he had found a hidden chamber. We found it, Nofit Jakob. Okay, I lost stress. Bishop Carroll has published the results of the medical investigation. The book has not received any notable attention, but at least Carroll has developed his skills as a physician. You want these two to get married. I mean, she doesn't have any claims, so you can have her. Let's help you with a new potion. I brewed a potion just like the emperor and <laughs> enciphered recipe dictated. Kaiserin Hildegard gratefully accepted my help, and soon, as we drank, as she drank the concoction, I could see the change in her. Now the light has returned to her eyes. I mean, yeah, she kind of hates me, but let's try to make her fall in love with me. That's my new project, by the way. Can I end this war? Still fighting them. You're still sick. Thing is, if this guy dies, we're gonna have claim on the Tsardom of Bulgaria. Now, let's actually remember. She likes me 73. We'll see this race or foe in the next 10 years, and then I'm gonna return and see how this option actually helps or doesn't, because I don't think it does. Oh, do we have any prisoners we can ransom? No. Oh, look at that. Bulgarians are actually fighting for their glory. We surrender under the Easterns. Excellent! Still can't form an alliance with him. Hmm. I could give him an artifact, but I'm gonna keep them for my sons. And my son's sons. So, this Kaiser doesn't have any claims to Germany. Okay, you can stand down. Most of you. And now, all of you. Excellent. Ah, Byzantines. Okay, I think we're doing fine. That was a huge war. It could have been worse. Castle Margat. The Knights of St. John's have established a new holding in the country of Tartossa. 
Permission to settle there was granted to them by the noble Duchess Takla of Tripoli. Their mighty castle will henceforth be known as Margat. Okay, people I can arrest. This guy because he's evil, this guy because he's stupid, and this guy because he's ambitious. And this woman because she tried to kill me. Anyway, we're still voting for this guy, right? Let's ask you... If I try to intimidate, that's not gonna work. How about this guy? Try to intimidate him. That worked. Wait, you're not a voter. Ah, finally. We have this. Okay, you were attacked by this guy. Can you peace out, please? Peace with Swabia. Excellent. That's because he likes me so much. And you can have Bavaria. Now that's gonna actually give him more power, but I think it's gonna be fine. We could have a private conversation. Speaking of which... I wish to formally invite you to my court for a period of festivities leading to my coronation. Sincerely, Emperor Edward of Britannia. Very well. Come on, seduce her. Please don't kill me. Are you kidding me? The castle Bert Gibraltar. Maybe I should stop doing that. Hey, you can be the keeper of the swan as well. I don't need new ingredients. Emperor Edward has spent some expenses with his coronation, as I was admiring the lavish sight offered by his palace. I was approached by the Emperor himself. After having talked to him for a while, I'm starting to think we might have a lot in common. We can become close friends. Do so! I can die, I can gain depressed or stressed. Let's go with stressed. And wrath? Yes. Also kind of wounded because this woman cut my head. That works? Hmm. <laughs> the perfect moment for it. The lowered heresy has appeared in Gordost. The Pope was baffled when Emperor Edward reached for the imperial crown in the middle of the ceremony and snatched away the golden cycle from his hands. Amongst the general amazement of the large crowd of noblemen gathered around him, Emperor Edward announced that from his reign forwards the papacy would hold no longer any power over the imperial throne. As in the past, I guess. I, I don't know the text. Hmm. When the ceremony finally concluded, Emperor Edward bid me farewell and dismissed me from my court, alongside all his other guests. What happened to your eye? Oh, so can I make my wife the new region? I can make Glitterhoof my lover my region. That would be amazing. Now it's gonna be you. Let's not try to seduce her anymore. How? What's the chance of me arresting her? Hundred percent. I could execute her, or I can release her. Let's just release you. And 
never try this again, please. You are still the keeper of the swans. I do need a new mail. Also, I do have a loan to repay the jewels. There you go. Okay, nothing to do but wait. Come on, dude. You need my alliance, otherwise you're gonna lose that. By the way, a Byzantine, are you fighting anyone else? No, but you don't have any monies. The one-handed. This guy's called the devil. You have one hand. Severely injured. So you didn't lose it quite that far away. Or maybe that's a different wound. Who knows? Your wife is pregnant. That's nice. A small spear throwing competition could be entertaining. And it's also a great way to envelop and battle techniques. Maybe you should arrange a contest at the court. Very well. I am one of the best fighters after all, and I won't. Glorious be this day. No one got mangled. As war grows to be a constant presence in my life, I have on several occasions freed, may also counter death. I gained death. Uh, <laughs> I gained brave. Should I negotiate with this? No. He's fine without me. Speaking of which, how long before we can change this law? Oh, look at that, my wife is pregnant. The castle of Belvoir. The Knights of St. John have established a new holding in Shakerdom of Safon. Permission to settle was granted to them by the noble Count Rathi of, Saf of Safed. Their mighty castle will henceforth be known as Belvoir. Dean Fidel's should tremble. Indeed. It's so ironic seeing the realm prosper. You're still sick or consumption. So you want to change this advisor, my spy master. How good are you as a spy master? Terrible. How dare you suggest something so inappropriate? <laughs> yeah, what's wrong with you, woman? Also, I could form this kingdom, can I? Carthenia. Are you... Plotting anything, it doesn't seem like it. Damn it, guys, start plotting. I need land. Here's the thing, though is anyone supporting a plot? Plot, plot, plot. Okay. Fabricate a claim. This guy's plotting, but I don't care. He's 5% threatening. How threatening am I? 71%. Still swaying her. Hmm. It's so hard to think about what I could do to endear Kaiserin Hildeberg. I'm already too perfect after all. Why would anyone need encouragement in order to enjoy the pleasure of being in good grace with me? Um, I guess let's send her one of my statues. Hmm. Kaiserin Hildeberg informed me that she is very flattered by the attention I have given her and that she hopes to remain within my good grace for longer still. That's nice. Okay, is there anything I can build here? No. Then let's work on my northern lands. This one, for example. Well, we can't actually do anything about that.
Can I demand Gavokin? I could. That's stupid. It's good tradition to have some gossip around the pregnant women in order to keep her calm and distracted from the tribulations of this delicate time in her life. As Hindenburg's husband, it is my duty to provide her with the support she needs. Despite some people right away. Okay. Let's lie to her face. I mean, she tried to kill me twice, though. She doesn't get to judge. Also, you suggest that I'm sleeping with a horse. What's wrong with you? You can be my regent from now on. He does like me, but only because... It doesn't matter. Once I have... Uh, when can I change this? Right. 54 in three more years. Once I change this law, I will definitely enact something to help me out. Here's more alcohol. He doesn't like me anymore. Why not? Imprison my child. I released her! And I have a son. Why wasn't I able to actually name him? Prince Gudrum of Germany. Okay, uh, let's take a look at dynasties. Look at my beautiful dynasty spreading around. Also, I do want the Kingdom of Hungary. What can I... How can I actually gain this? Let's take a look at this woman. Mm. That's a weak claim from you as well. Let's invite you to court. As is tradition, my wife Hindenburg underwent her churching after recovering from cleansing herself from the recent pregnancy. When she returned home, she was steaming with excitement. While taking the holy commemoration, she had a wondrous vision of an angel leading our son Gunther to glory. The child is surely destined for greatness. Oh, nice. Okay, who shall have it? Do you have any children? This guy. He's five, however. Okay, what about you? No. You're still the Kaiser of the Kaiser, the King of Germany. I am the Kaiser of Germany. Okay, this is a Viceroy. I'm very slowly trying to fix the realm, but it's not working as I was expecting it to. Okay, let's seek out someone. No, no, search the realm. My dynasty. Not married. It needs to be a male. This guy is only nine. And you're the son of this one. Okay, is there anyone else who can claim Hungary? Holy War for Galish. Galich. That's here. You don't actually have any connections. Oh, you do. Thought this mountain continues on. It's a nomad tribe, so you're gonna lose it once you die. Why even bother then? 
Right, go here and stop them. have this 16 year old woman, invite her to court as well. Send you as a special interest, so should you be? Are you part of my court as well? Yes, so this guy might inherit Hungary. Can I declare the war for him? Let's plot to kill him. Invite people and just wait. Okay, let's have a private conversation with this one. Try to seduce her. Oh, come on. This guy truly doesn't have any chance whatsoever for happiness. Someone is voting against my choice, and in fact voting for this guy, so... Why do you like him so much? Let's try to intimidate this guy. No, try to tell him to... Can I... Yeah, stop backing... Oh, you're plotting something. Well then. There you go. I'm not gonna... You know... Let's do it. But I think I'm going to do that next time. So, thank you all for joining me, and I'm gonna see you then. Goodbye.